This time on Spotlight Series, we've got something of a rarity, a flipper from Emerson Knives. This new version of the CQC7 is only the second flipper in Emerson's repertoire, and it's an admirable update of a classic model. In the closed position, this looks just like the previous versions of the CQC7, with the single outlier being the absolutely monstrous flipper tab. Its ample size makes it really easy to engage, and the deployment action is some of the most satisfying I've felt in a while. It really takes no effort on the user's part to get a swift, snappy action. Now, while the flipper may be the cool new kid on the block, you're really spoiled for choice when it comes to opening this bad boy. You've also got the ambidextrous thumb disc, as well as the ubiquitous Emerson Wave opener, both of which give you a lightning-fast, effortless deployment. The blade on this model is just about 3 and a third inches of S35VN stainless steel in a tanto shape with a chisel grind on one side and flat on the other. The G10 handle scales are built over some reasonably thick titanium liners, so you've got a nice sturdy liner lock to keep the blade extended. The G10 itself is ultra grippy in the way you've come to expect from Emerson for a very reliable no-slip grip. The handle is the same size and shape as previous iterations of the CQC7, granting a comfortable ergonomic hold. A bonus on this model is that the flipper tab doubles as a finger guard, so you actually get a safer handling experience than ever before. It's a flow-through handle, and the use of barrel spacers in place of a backspacer helps keep the weight manageable. To round out the features here, you're looking at a right-side tip-up pocket clip and a lanyard hole at the butt of the handle. All in all, Emerson has taken one of the best tactical folders on the market and made it even better by adding a flipper, and most importantly, by doing it right. You can click the annotation or the link in the description to learn more about the new CQC7, and don't forget to check back every week for all new episodes of Spotlight Series. Thanks for watching from the Knife Center, serving the web community since 1995.